Welcome YouTubers, this is Pocket Digit here and today I'm going to show you another Ichiban Kuchi that I did today as well on December 7, the same for the Star Wars one but of course, if you haven't checked out the video out yet, please watch that first because this is really insane and it's my second time to get the last prize so yeah, back to where we are so I'm going to show you is the Ichiban Kuchi Harry Potter and it's of course of the ones which is only two prizes which is uh, A and B and please try to ignore this this is also the the virus from the the hand foot mouth disease but don't worry this will not spread to anyone it's just kind of affect the nails right here so try to ignore this as much as possible so the, the list of the a and b prices there's like a total of 40 tickets two tickets for the a price while the remaining 38 tickets is the b price but when i went to that store in kuantong and that was my very first time to went to that place or my second time and um, of course in fact I was wearing this one you can see my photo right here on the selfie I took a photo of this and yes I didn't do a preview on this but I did do the unpacking um, but yeah because of the stupid virus I recorded this on July something it uh, removed my video and effort so I just want to let you have a quick few seconds look on this one it's the Time Turner Necklace from Hermione, which you can see it on the movie 5, if you can recall that. So I'm just play, putting a display just to have this theme for the Harry Potter. So before I will show you my um, uh, live reaction, these are the following lists for the A and B price. So the A price, of course, you know, is Harry Potter with, of course, his wand. It's one like uh, 35 cm, if I remember that correctly. It actually can glow at the tip of his uh, wand, but I'm not so sure if that is also uh, a pen besides like a glowing thing like that. So moving on to the B price. So the B price you can tell there's a total of 10 of them and they're based on the main characters. So if I can get this correctly, yeah, uh, so if I try to remember. So the first one of course, Harry Potter, and then um, Hermione, Ron, Draco Malfoy, and then the boy, the one has the pet frog, the one uh, sometimes unlucky. And then number 6, Luna, uh, 7, Sirius Black. And then it is uh, Dumbledore. Nine is Professor Snape, which is my sister's favorite character, not Narf. She loves Snape so badly. And then number ten, Lord Voldemort. So these are the ten characters, and then they're they're ones on the B price. So when I went there, there's only six tickets, literally six. So I just get uh, all of them. But of course, I did two first. I thought I would get A by chance, but no. Nope. But since I, have, I still have enough money, so I get the remaining four. So enjoy my uh, videos, of course, too close, but I will be putting them uh, two videos together, so don't worry about that. Because So yeah, before I start opening the B, B, the B prize and then the A for last, yeah, I kind of feel sorry for the couple there that they want to try the lottery, like the remaining uh, four tickets. 
I really feel bad for them because the moment I got in, I paid the remaining um, money. I don't want to tell you how much I draw for that. They wanted to draw this, but because they noticed that I took everything, so like, man, I'm sorry, but I'm also a Harry Potter fan there, so they don't have it anymore. So I was the last one to get the remaining six. So I'm so sorry, people who live here in Hong Kong. I'm so sorry if I get everything. I'm sorry. Salam Moisia. So yes, so. Back to where we are, so let's put the price A aside. As you can see, here's the Harry Potter wand right here, and of course, it can glow. Yes, this is the, the style and it's brown color for the A price. B price, this is how they look like, and it's in blue color. And you can see here the credits of Harry Potter characters, names, and related of uh, NCD, in this? NCDA. And of course, uh, Warner Bros. Entertainment, WB Shelf, and then all the credits there. I don't want to read it. Then you can see all that there, so forth. So this is the B price. So I'm gonna show B price first. So like I said, they're around like 31 to 31 something to 40 cm. Depends on the character. So I cannot tell you or tell you this, the specific. Um, the length of the ones. So let's start opening them. And yes, before I start opening them, just to let you all know that if I ever get like a double or a triple, whatever, like the same wand, oh, so sorry, the same uh, wand, I will definitely uh, sell them. But of course, it's only here in Hong Kong. So yeah, I'm so sorry for those of you who are living in other countries that subscribe to my channel. I'm so sorry. Because I don't want to take the risk of my own credit card, and I only use my credit card for uh, for my family. So, just in case if I get doubles whatsoever, the same ones, I will sell it and post it onto my Instagram, and I will sell this in a cheaper price because of the holiday season, the holidays or uh, Christmas like that depends what you call it like that. So I'm going to make it fair and square, but I will talk about it later. And let's start with opening. So let's start opening the ones with this white one right here. They're still brand new, no scratches. So the first box. And yep, on the ones right here, you can see there's the display of the B. And here's the back side of the warning, and there's that Ichiban Kuji. And I'm so happy that they have this one here in Hong Kong, comparing to the other. Uh, the, the last month in Ichiban Kuji, it's not really worth it, so I just go for this. So let's open the first box. Okay, so here we go. And yes, this is actually very like, it's, hard, it's really a hardboard card box, uh, car box, so it's going to be hard to remove it. So, one. Two, three. So we got is Harry Potter right here. So like I just said a while ago in the video, if you don't know which one, they will have this uh, mini paper that uh, allows you to to distinguish the character in Japanese and English name, which is a good thing. Then here is the instructions like that. So just remove the ones the handle right here and it, it reveals the, the pen. So this is really a nice one from Harry Potter. And yep, this is uh, B price B and this is B1. So look at the style right here. So before I open this up, let's open the other guys first. So first we got is Harry Potter. Now the second one. Getting that aside, of course, and of course, having a hard time just removing this. Oh my god, I'm so sorry, box. Oh well. Alright, so, one, two, three. This looks like Malfoy's, I think. Draco Malfoy? Malfoy? Oh yeah, here. So it's B2. Wow. So this is his one. And it looks so nice, actually. I just don't know the, the size, of course. 
let's see if they have a uh, science fair. Nope, they just show you like how do you open it. So putting the B side right here. So, so far we got this B1 and B2 which is Harry's and Malfoy. So let's open up the third box. Oh my gosh, it's really getting hard to move and you, the moment you just try to move continuously on moving these boxes and yeah, kind of damage it so I hope it's not the same because it's going to be embarrassing if I'm going to give it to the seller. So this is the third one, so one, two, three. This is Luna's, wow, because I can recognize the tip here, the design. So we got this Luna. Here you can see even her full name, like so. So this is B9. There we go. This is B9. So we have our last two. Let's see who we got. And another annoyment of the box. So here we go, our fourth box. One, two, three. So it seems like we have a duplicate of Harry Potter right here. Alright, so this one I will definitely sell it, of course, here in Hong Kong. So it seems like my I can't really give a lot of luck to my sister, which is the sad part because I'm not so sure if that last one right here will give me a lot for my sister. She loves Snape's version or Dumbledore. Alright, putting this one down because I'm going to sell that one. So let's go to that last one right here. Hopefully this will give my sister luck, cause I also spent money for her for this one. Let's open this up. Kind of a bit disappointed how I just removed this, like ripped this off, but opening it right here is much more faster. So here we go. To reveal who is the last one on this fifth box. One, two, three. No freaking way! It's not really my sister's aim or the favorite character, but you can tell by this and this. It's Dumbledore! Oh my freaking glob! That is the good way to end the B price. So this is B5 right here. Albus Dumbledore. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Yes, so it seems like only one. Uh, out of the five B prizes, I'll be selling the Harry Potter one, and I can tell you right now. So for those of you living here in Hong Kong and you didn't get the chance because it's my fault to get everything, and if you're a huge fan of Harry, as plus he's the main character of this Harry Potter film, I will charge you beside instead of like 150, I will charge you 100 Hong Kong dollars. So don't worry, I'll post it again on my Facebook or on my Instagram, depends. So just, uh, on my Facebook is, uh, my name is Nina Jasmine and for my Instagram is the same username of this uh, YouTube channel. So, wow, I can't wait to open these up and show to you all. So, putting that aside. So, I'll be showing, yep, all four. Oh my gosh. Out of rectangle boxes. So let's look up first is the Harry Potter one. And look at that. It's not really like long, but look at that. It's like really at the articulations. And you can see the W uh, B E right here. 
and then Sensor S16, uh, BP2016, made in China. But look at that! Wow, it's so beautiful. Look at the detail of it. Not really like the ones that's so close to one in the in Singapore, though in the Universal Studio. But my, my gosh, look at it! It's so magnificent. It's like you feel like you're a magician already. And look at that so detail on his wand. So in order to, of course. To know where's the pen is, just move this one slowly. Make sure of that ceremony pointer pen uh, wand. Let's check out if this works. I have to find a paper up here. Let's see if it works. So it works as proof. So, so this. Oh no 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 no! Oh no! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! I made the mark. Oh. <laughs> no, I made a mark up there. So I pulled this down. Oh my gosh! So this is how you close it back down. And oh my gosh, I had to use the wipes later after I finished doing the video. So this is Harry Potter's wand. Let's have that closer look again. There we go. This is Harry Potter's wand. So beautiful. Following up is uh. Draco Malfoy. And look at that. Like, his wand is like very simple, but uh, how they make the details, like, you can't really see it from my phone, but when you look at the brown parts right here, it's like you can see it's like almost like a little bit of a wood color. Like, do you see the little bit of a brown and then dark brown? Wow, really nice. Then here it's like fully pure black. Then the credits is right here, I don't have to repeat it. And of course, the pen slots right this area. Make sure I don't paint, I don't make a mark on my wardrobe again. Yep, there's the pen, and I have to show you that. And of course, there's the gap right here, the middle one, to close back at the lower part right here. Sorry, it's a little bit blurry. Let me see if I can put the back part for me. Yeah. There we go. So, this is... Draco Malfoy is one. Third one is no other than Lunas. And look at that, it looks like a really like a, a paintbrush. But of course it's like a flower like here. So beautiful. It really looks like a paintbrush to be honest. That's really nice. And then her pen point is right here. You can see the line there, that's very obvious. So just remove this slowly, and you can see there's a cube, um, cube there, right there. That, uh, that there. So you can tell where to open and close. Doing it slowly. I don't want to make a mark again. Yep. So this is Luna's pen right here, or one pen. So close it back down. There we go. Yep. Nice texture. All the way you can see the detail of the black marking there. Wow. Nicely well done. So this is Luna's pen. Last but not least is Dumbledore's or, or Albus Dumbledore's wand. So look at this one. I think he may be the longest one because while you uh while you uh, while you're like watching the other three uh, ones, you notice that it's a little bit uh, shorter like that. Like you can't really see. I had to put at least this far, this length, just to make sure that it really fits. And I'm using the fish eye camera right here because if I remove it, it's too close. So look at this one, Dumbledore's one. It's so nice, especially the ones right here. I don't know what does it really mean, but it's so nice. Then look at that. Wow. That is so magnificently well done. I really like that detail. So, that's open right um, here. Let's see if I get it right. Yep, right here. Then you can see that cube again. Yep. This is how it looks like for his uh, wand pen for uh, Albus Dumbledore. So, putting it back. 
and here is Albus Dumbledore's wand. So we're now left is for the price A right here. It's of course Harry Potter's wand that of course it can glow, but we're not so sure if it's also a pen, but we'll find out right now. So I had to post a video because I know this will take me forever just to open it. So I finally opened it in the proper way, which did not take me that long, which is finally. <laughs> so yep, let's open this and we don't have to count one to three anyway. Yep, the same thing, but let's see if this is a, like a wand, like a pen or not. like. Just like a glowing pen, that's fine. So let's see the instruction right here. Okay, never mind. Alright, so the switch button is right this area. There. And then the glowing is on the tip. Okay, so let's see if this is actually just... Uh, just like a replica kind of toy. We'll have to find out. So let's take this one right here. Did you all see it? And I realized this one doesn't have a proper lid. Okay. So it's the same thing like the ones Harry Potter's one, but yeah, it's actually a little bit lighter. Alright, so we have this sticker right here, the plastic thing to make sure that you don't press. So the button is right here, the second one. So let's try to roll this because normally when it comes to uh, roleplay toys, I normally put them back in order to save the uh, battery. So this requires uh, at least 2 uh, two LR444 battery. I'm not sure what it is, but I'll try to Google it. As it says, I saw it here just now. So since I remove it, and of course I will keep it, just to make sure I save battery. Yep. This is where you change your battery and the details, okay? And it's lighter, like, lighter than the uh, Harry Potter pen. And yep, this is the 35cm. So let's try to press it. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful! Yep, let's have the closer look. So this is the, the, the flusher right here. Oops, too bright. Oh my gosh. With the yellow glowing, but inside is white, but when you... But because of the details right here they they painted, it's of course oops. You can see that it glows, so let's try checking it at the dark. So I'll do the light. Oops. Yeah, it's about to on the dark, what the heck? Alright, let's go it. Alohamora. Oh my gosh. Gadium Leviosa. Oh my gosh, it's so weird because like I don't want to stop, but I have to stop. And let's have that closer look again. Oh dear, 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 it is so beautiful. So this is Harry Potter's wand. So apparently this one doesn't have the pen. As you can see, I cannot pull it. It's just like the actual toy, like the, like a roleplay toy. So I'll put this back and I'll join. I will have fun a little bit later for this one, not now. Because I want to do the comparison of the wand of Harry's and this one. So yeah, I had to zoom up a little bit because it's a little bit far and I had to adjust the stand of my, um, for my camera. I mean for the, the ones to hold my camera. So this is the one, the roleplay one that can glow. And this the one is the one. So you can see that actually, yeah, this one is like just a little uh, inch like uh, shorter than the actual one and the, the detail is actually different I just realized well this one is yeah I don't know how you explain the color or whatsoever but you can tell by the detail as I'm just trying to rotate it that you all see that uh, handle right there the differences you can tell by the color then even the brown part right here that's definitely different yeah, even the brown fur right here, like the pen one and the uh, the roleplay one, they're actually very different. But my god, that is how they look like. Like if you judge it by the pen and the roleplay uh, toy. So yeah, this is the B price and the A price uh, comparison. And then for the other prices, I will just uh, take a photo and then compare it 
like of this uh, roleplay toy and then with the other uh, three wands. So this is the one again and so desperate that I want to press it so that I better not. So in my conclusion, my gosh I just love these prices. I really do hope they have more Harry Potter uh, Ichiban Kujis for of course Harry Potter. I know they have a lot like few years ago but that time I really didn't know about the Ichiban Kuji. I wasn't that uh, active about this Ichiban Kujis. But yeah, I'm just so happy that Ichiban Kuji have provided some that's that's not relating to anime or Disney, but they also focus on the international ones like, you know, Harry Potter, Star Wars, like that. And I'm so happy that this one has it in Hong Kong and only in Kuantan. And, of course, so sorry for those of you who live in Hong Kong that I got the remaining ones, but don't worry. Then the B ones right here, which I planned, which I put it back, which is Harry Potter's wand, I will definitely sell this one for 100 Hong Kong dollars fair price and the cheapest one so before i end this video just to let you all know the one that i went there the card uh hero right here uh like if like i mentioned or maybe i just repeat it so if you purchase more than 500 you can get a free membership credit here you can be a member from them and you can get a bunch of cards there and then here's the code whatsoever like that they'll help you scan give you a discount give you a free gift and that's good so look at that, really love that one. And if you want to follow them, you can follow them through Facebook, Instagram, and I can just post that the screenshot I did. Uh, then there's all in Chinese like that. You please, uh, I really do uh, recommend you to follow them through uh, Instagram, Facebook, because those people in there, they're very friendly. And besides that, they also have uh, some Ichiban Kuji, but not a lot. But for the price, well, let's say it's like between the ones in Mong Kok, Yamate, and the others like that. So they're actually just an average, like fair price for when it comes to the Japanese lottery. So, if you enjoyed this video, guys, of this uh, Harry Potter uh, wands, click the like button, subscribe to my channel, stay tuned for more Ichiban Kuji reviews or anime stuffs in the further future. So, this is it, guys. So, see you all in the next anime preview. Okay, I just realized that this uh, roleplay toy that you can just click it one time and then it will glow. And then click it again, it will turn off. And ah, uh, too bad there's no ah uh, spell to remove this. Like, it's not like wasting wipes, like to of course save the environment. At least use a bit of magic to remove this. Like, any spell for this? Oh, come on, please remove. No.